So what we're hoping to do now is we're going to check can we simulate high altitude training from a sitting room using the Oxygen Advantage program. Uh, we have a recreational athlete and he is using a turbo trainer and basically there's a little pulse oximeter as before which is resting and it's a Nolan brand and you see there his oxygen saturation is normal at 95-96% and his heart rate is in around 98-100%. So what I'm going to do is now, I'm going to ask Lee, who's familiar with the Oxygen Advantage program, to start incorporating it in. And we're going to check. Now basically all this involves is altering his breathing. And there's no device, you know, there's nothing that you need. It's a very simple program. And we're going to just start following to see, can Lee simulate high altitude training? So I'm just going to hold it at this. So you see there that the oxygen saturation is 96, 95, 93. Now it's down to 88, so already we're in simulation of high altitude training. So it's down to 81%, 83%. So Lee, you don't need to go below 80%, and what you can do is do it intermittently as well. So you're still at 86% there, 82%, so there's never any torture. This is all about, it's going to be a challenge, but we never want stress. Now when we drop down to 84% or 80%, we're simulating in around 5,000 meters, or in around 16,000 feet. So you see oxygen saturation back up to 92, back down to 90%. And this is measuring how fully loaded are the red blood cells with oxygen. And because Lee is changing his breathing, he's able to alter the amount of air that he's taking into his body. And because oxygen is being ex extracted by the cells and he's not replenishing it, we're dropping it. So we're able to simulate high altitude training. We're able to simulate a height of between 15,000 and 18,000 feet, between 4,500 and 5,400 meters, and now it's again, it's back up, it's back down to 83%, down to 80%, and just leave, maybe just intensify it just for about 10, 15 seconds. So it's going back up again, it's still below, it's still below. Once you go below 90%, though, you're below. So this is a specific technique that I developed um, and it's part of the oxygen technique. It's only one, the oxygen advantage program, and you see it there at 83%. And again, we've just simulated high altitude training from the comfort of your sitting room.